Okay, look, you know, there's, there's no set time limit on this. If you're feeling uncomfortable about staying at my apartment, please don't. It's not about me feeling uncomfortable. You really thought about this. On every level. There is so much to consider here, Bailey. I have, and I really do want to raise my son. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I do. All right, then. So, um... I won't stand in your way. You won't? No, you've made up your mind, so what else is there? Uh, I don't know. I thought you'd freak out and, you know, scream at me, yell, yell at me, tell me how sick I am for taking him away from you. You're his biological mother. You have the right. Okay, you must be holding back because we're in a public place. But just let loose. I mean, slap me. I know you want to. It's okay. I don't get it. How can you not be mad? Because we had a deal. You were going to move into the apartment and spend time with Stuart alone and see if you could actually follow through on the adoption, and you did. So you <laughs> feared out. How could I be possibly be mad? You bonded with him. You started <laughs> a life with him. Liz, is there anything you need? You love him so much. I knew this was coming. I knew from the second that he was put into your arms. I saw that connection. That's the most powerful connection in the world. I know because I had it. Hasn't being cocky gotten you in enough trouble? Don't make the same mistake twice, okay? Don't assume victory. Hey, we're just not finished messing with you or Amanda. Well, he's not well. I think he is finished. No, yes. well, according to him. No, I think he is. There were test results. There's medication he's taken, apparently. Angie talked to a top hematologist. I think it's done. I mean, I think it's real. I don't think he's going to live. I think he's dying. Okay, but he's not dead. Not yet, anyway. With an ego like that, he's going to use every last minute he has to come up with some miracle cure. Fine, but he's not God. Well, somebody should tell him that. Which leads me to my other issue, Amanda. He's not finished screwing with her either, okay? He's going to use every opportunity that comes up to, to, to mess with her head, to suck her back in before he kicks the bucket. I got to believe that she hates the guy. I mean, I, got, I mean, what else have I got? That's not going to matter, don't you see? Your wife, if nothing else, Amanda's got a huge heart. Just wait until he starts playing the, the, the dying daddy card, you know? Walking around the house, back and forth, crying every day about losing his precious son. She's going to start feeling for him, okay? She's not going to have a choice. Which means you have to stay strong. You cannot afford to forget who he is or what he is capable of. Forget? You think I could honestly forget the guy who's torn my life apart? No, I... In fact, I hope he sticks around long enough for me to return the favor. My time is almost up. This disease is stealing the days, the hours, the minutes I have with my son. I don't want you acting nice just because you know it's almost over. Six months from now, you'll be reunited with your husband. You'll have Trevor. You can celebrate then. Even though I have no doubt Jake is already planning a bon voyage party. David. <sighs> Look, I'm gonna go lie down. I wanna save my strength, what's important. My last moments with my son. It's not going to be easy, so I'm going to go as far as I have to. This is too far. Execution at close range is way too extreme. I know what I'm doing, Kat. I know how to make Kendall fall in love with me. 
by scaring the hell out of her. She thinks that you just shot me. Whatever it takes. Devane, when you showed up at my front door after my husband died, look at me. You were so caring and so sensitive. What happened? I wised up. Nice guys finish last. I know more Mr. Nice Guy. I know what I want, and I'm going to get it. You're not going to get it. Not I, like this. Kat, was you just... Oh, my God. Look, what I need you to do right now is go play dead. I need to get back to Kendall. 